up everybody music city driver otherwise known as chris once again coming at you from nashville so <clears throat> in my last video i mentioned that uber pool has now officially gone live in nashville and it has however it appears that some drivers have different options when it comes to pool <clears throat> this right here on my screen is a screenshot from my friend who's part of a facebook group that we're part of um here in the middle tennessee nashville area <clears throat> and he unfortunately cannot unselect pool he has just the option of uberx and pool combined and then deliveries which he is not doing these for some weird reason i don't i mean i opted out of eats a long time ago because i tried it and didn't like it not really for me um <clears throat> however if you look at my screen this is the weird part okay my screen has the ability to select as you can see uberx and pool or not or i could just deselect uberx and do only pool if i wanted to why would I want to do that? I don't know. But I can do Uber X and Pool, I guess, together. It's very odd, though. It may be because I'm an XL, um, because people could take advantage of that and put six people in instead of four. I'm not really sure. So, very odd. I just thought I would share this with you guys. Um, another thing I wanted to mention, a couple of things I wanted to mention about Lyft Line and Uber Pool <clears throat> specifically, is that... There are a couple of silver linings, I guess you could say, to this. Um, number one, you do have the ability to have more tips, I guess. Um, if it's one to two people each pickup, you've got, you know, for a regular UberX vehicle, if each person selects, you know, two passengers, then you've got a maximum of four. That's only two. <clears throat> You'll get two, you know, 50 cents extra for doing the two pickups. Um, but if you get four, if you get four single riders, that's four pickups. So that's another dollar extra, um, plus your normal rates, which is in Nashville is five cents lower on pool than it is on Uber X. Um, <clears throat> but you also get four times the opportunity to get maybe a dollar tip or something. Who knows? Because they're paying a little bit less, so maybe they'll be likely to tip more. Who knows? Um, and also, if you are going for a promotion like a quest, each one of those riders that you pick up counts as a trip. So. If you pick up four separate riders on an Uber pool, that counts as four trips for only doing one trip. <clears throat> so those are the, and the same thing on Liftline. Um, Liftline, each passenger you pick up counts as a separate trip. So um, up to four, like I said, if they choose to do two people on a trip, though, that's going to limit your possibilities on the number of trips you get, etc. But those are two positives that I can think of for Uber X, I mean, for Uber pool and Liftline. So Anyway, I just thought I would share that with you guys. I hope you guys are doing well. And um, if you're out there and you have any experience with Uber Pool or Lyft Line, please put it in the comments below. I want to know what your, your experiences are, um, whether you're in the Nashville area or not. I'm just trying to get some experiences out there to share this with people so that they can you know, make the decision on whether they want to try it or not. But unfortunately, it looks like if you are a an Uber X only driver, you may not have the option to separate out uber x and pool so post that down there as well in the comments if you are an uber x driver in a city that has pool please put in the comments below give me a, uh, put a screenshot up if you can <clears throat> to show me the just like this screenshot is where you can you know eat deselect or select pool um that'd be great information to pass on like i said i suspect it may be because i drive an xl vehicle um, they don't feel they feel like maybe passengers may try to take advantage of that and put six people in instead of just a maximum of four possibly I don't know um, or maybe they're just taking into consideration for once the fact that XL drivers spend more money on maintenance gas etc <clears throat> so anyway thank you guys for watching please like comment share and subscribe if you're looking to drive for uber or lyft um, look at my promo codes below. If you've already signed up for Uber and didn't use a promo code, also look in there for instructions on how to add a promo code later. You can always still get that guarantee even if you've already taken your first ride. So just check the links below. And also, like I said, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. And please share your experiences with LiftLine and Uber Pool because I would really like to get some other people's, other drivers' comments and experiences. So with that, you guys have a great day. And if you're out driving, drive safe.